this is what we are going to do in this video first of all we will build a machine learning model and then finally we will deploy a machine learning model and we will integrate it with a web application this is what the web application will look like we will take the input from the user when we click the predict portability it will actually give us the predicted value this is what you are going to do in this video in this video let us see how to deploy a machine learning model so that we can access it anywhere from the model that we are going to build is that is that of a water portability prediction we will use the following features like ph hardness solids you can see in the screens with the presence of this content in water we will be predicting whether the water is drinkable or not so these are the features ph hardness solids chloromyce sulfate etc and portability is the our target feature if the portability is zero then that water is not drinkable if its value is one then that water will be drinkable with the following contents i have simply used the logistic regression algorithm to build this model so i just imported the logistic regression algorithm and then trying the model and finally test it and build the model this is just a simple model without fine tuning we get the model accuracy of 0.6 this value is of the without fine tuning if you fine tune then we can get at least to 0.8 or 9 for just simplicity we will take this model finally i have to we have build the model i take the custom input from the user in the form of list you can see in the screen then i transform the list into a python's pandas data frame then i scale the data frame into a standardized user input finally i feed this input to the model and get the prediction if the prediction is 1 then the water is drinkable if it is not and then i just print it the water sample is predicted to be non potable so this is all about the introduction about the model that we have at our hand using this model we going to deploy so that we can pass input to the model that we have deployed so that we can get the output deploy this model will be using something called the model bit platform model bit is an uh, online platform that will help us to deploy machine learning model so just go to google and type model bit and click on the first results that appear in the search this is the dashboard of the website first of all you will have to sign up or sign in so i will have, I have already i have the account so i will just click on the sign in option and i choose my email address so i have already deployed two models predict energy and predict water portability so this is the dashboard in the dashboard we have these models so let's come to our google collab and establish a session from this google collab to the model bit dashboard before we deploying our model we will have to create a function that will take all the inputs and just return the predicted value we will have to create a function like that so that the model bit platform gets deployed so for this we going to create a one simple function that we just take the input and just return the prediction value from the model so let's get started so first of all let's import our model bit so just type pip install model bit in a separate cell and click on this run icon it will install the model bit model for you finally after the installation is complete i will just copy the function from the other collab and explain to you so this is the function we have so the function is the predict water portability this has the following parameters as the input it will take ph and its input type should be flow hardness solids chloromyce sulfate conductivity etc and the output type should be of float so these are the inputs that we will take from the user and uh, this is just the comments using the input that we got from the user we will create a data frame and store it in a data variable finally we will feed the data to the model and get the prediction value and just return it so this is the function that we will be deploying to the model bit so let's run this code successfully executed then finally establish a session from this google collab to the model bit account for this just type model bit or login above this line just type import model bit now run this shell now we will get a link just click on that link to establish a session so continue with google 
and sign it to the model with account that you have created after you sign in you will get a pop-up like your kernel has been connected to model bit so just dismiss this and come to our google collab now we have established a session to the model bit account now we are ready to deploy our machine learning algorithm for this just type model bit dot deploy and the name of the function is this is the function that we are going to deploy credit water portability since i have already had the credit water portability deploy in this model bit account i will change the function name to something else so just change the function name to water prediction i will also change in the function itself water prediction just run this code and now the successfully runs let's run our model bit dot deploy code so the deployment has been started you can see in the screen as you can see now our model has been successfully deployed if you refresh the model bit dashboard you will get the water prediction model as you can see we get the water prediction model has been successfully deployed if you click on that you will get the api endpoints with the help of these endpoints you can access the machine learning model from anywhere we just have to pass the user input to these api endpoints and you can get the output or you can say you will get the prediction value so just copy this url highlighted in the green text so this is the url that we will be used to access the model that we have just deployed to send a get request to the following url we will need the request model from python and we also need the json model so run this shell finally after we have imported the required packages then we will send a post the request to the above url so that we can get the prediction value so we will send a post the request with the following headers headers is a dictionary that contains content type it will be of the json then we will create another dictionary this dictionary will actually contain the user input so data equal to for the user input we will just copy a list that we have defined earlier so i will just copy this list and paste it here so this will be our input finally we will send this data to the above url request dot post this will take the following arguments url and the headers equal to headers and json equal to data finally the output equal to request dot json then we will just print the output to get our result so just run this shell as you can see we get the predicted value of one that means the water is drinkable since we have deployed the model with the help of the url you can actually send the user input to this url and get the return value with the help of this you can actually dev develop your web application for this model bit i have actually developed your website that will take the user inputs from the user and it will predict whether the whatever is uh, drinkable or not from the user input so the website link is this so i will just open this so this is the website that i have developed it will take the inputs from the user so i will give the random input and if we click the predict portability it will send a post request to the url that we have deployed in the model bit account and finally we will get the return value so i have displayed the return value so since we get 0, 0.00 something that water is not drinkable the model bit is a great platform to deploy your machine learning models so that you can actually build your uh, web applications from the model that you have developed.